Ladies and gentlemen, everybody out there, it's Philip 20 and I'm back. I've got some cool information for you today. Something that's not very specifically difficult, but really, really cool. Oh well, I don't know, maybe it is difficult to some people and I apologize for that. But this is what we're gonna talk about. We are running Bitcoin miners. For years now, I've been running Bitcoin miners. I've been running on solar for about a year. The Magnum, we ran it pretty much uh, maximum capacity and it just couldn't keep up. Right now we're at 4.2 kilowatts of power consumption. That's about half of what this inverter is designed to do. If it's not perfectly balanced across both loads, you have some trouble. And it took a little while for me to get that balance. Actually, I just, you know, added a little more power after I tried to balance things. But I've learned over time that uh, my house is not totally perfectly balanced and I'm pretty dis disappointed with that. There's not a lot I can do unless I redo all the wiring in the house. At least the refrigerator, uh, dishwasher, the, the mini stove. I got a mini stove that I used to use on the wall and the window air conditioner is on one circuit. So by putting that heat pump in on 230 volts, that'll balance it. Plus that air conditioner. Uh, I'd like to put it on a 110 volt tr to 240 volt transformer and run it. But let's just not talk about that. What we're talking about is that uh, Bitcoin mining. It's difficult to run a bunch of miners. Uh, this thing is running, it's hot. This garage is always hot, it's loud, but it's really cool. This has a auxiliary relay. So what I've got going into it is 110 volts. Actually, I think this will, is a 230 volt tr uh, relay. So the coil that energizes this circuit is 240 volts, so I don't have to run a transformer. So what I do is I run one side of the power from the inverter into it, the other side through this red wire into the AUX circuit which AUX stands for relay the AUX circuit it uh, seems to work fine with it it's worked fine for a while so I'm gonna leave it that way and then out of it I got a fuse link that goes to the relay that powers 230 volts now once 230 volts is energized into that because of the relay when it turns on and off it sends one leg of power to the other leg of power that's already at the bitcoin miners and turns it on so it's like an on off switch on this so you take a small current relay and put it into a big current relay and drive our bitcoin miners with it so it's pretty simple. Free money. I don't have to sell to the grid power. It's free money. So I don't have to worry about doing any permits with the grid power. I've already got permits for this stuff, but I don't have to worry about getting the specific grid sell permit. Because here, the only way I can sell back is I put a whole nother electric meter on the wall outside and only give them a hundred percent of the power it's late in the evening the bitcoin miners just now turned off so uh we went to pulling 4.2 kilowatts to 1.4 kilowatts and that's running everything in the house besides the Bitcoin miners now. That includes uh, a get desktop gaming PC with two graphics cards that my daughter's playing video games on. That includes my editing PC downstairs. That includes my mother-in-law's TV 
That includes the both upstairs televisions for the other two kids. So yeah, we're uh, running quite a bit. And whenever the voltage jumps back up, it'll turn back on. Automatically turns on and off. But this is really cool about it. Uh, you know, it's seven o'clock in the evening and I've been running Bitcoin for free all day long. It turned off. It might turn on back and forth a couple of times before, uh, you know, bedtime, but who cares? But now, I guess I'll see you guys later. This is Philip 20. Peace out. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for watching all the way to the end of the video. There's lots more content coming. Click the subscribe button below. Make sure you come back for more because there's great content always coming up every day in this channel. See you next time. Peace.